107.5. Now we're set up right outside the radio station at Grand and Pile here in beautiful downtown Clovis. What we have is the course. What did you describe the course there, Duff? Uh, it's pretty easy, Steve. It's actually sanctioned. This is high quality. This is the best course you're going to find in Clovis. I guarantee you that. Uh, if you look here to my left, your right, Steve, you will see the starting line. Yeah. It's, uh, like I said earlier, it's a piece of blue painter's tape. And it says, start. Yeah. Uh, we're going to start there with this radio pinched between our thighs. Okay. And we are going to waddle our way down to the other piece of blue tape, which has got to be six, seven miles. At least. Down the sidewalk. Are they, is it going to be like a marathon where there'll be people holding out like sponges and little glasses of water and things like that? <laughs> Some chafing cream, yeah. I hope. Yeah. yeah. And that's exactly right. And so what's going to happen is well, the three of us are going to compete. Rooney, Moon, and Peacock. Steve, Duffy, and Casey. Best time wins. Best time wins. If you drop the box between your from between your thighs, you're out. Okay? You do not get to win. Now, what we've done is we have allowed people to go onto our Facebook fan page. We just now cut off the voting and vote for who they think will win. If you guessed the right player from the morning show, you'll be in the drawing for the free family four-pack into the fair, into the arena cross, onto the midway, all absolutely free. Here is Casey Peacock with the current tally of who our listeners a win. It's going to be me. Currently, Steve's 21, you're 25, and I'm 32. Well, it's not quite the runaway it was earlier. No, they pretty much have you and I in a dead heat is what it sounds like, Steve. They have no faith in my thighs whatsoever. No, and they've got old rock thighs here uh, coming in well ahead of both of us. Who's the dude down there with the camera? Uh, that's Mark. Mark just, and anytime you mention somebody doing something with their thighs, Mark has a camera. It's, uh, it's scary, but he does. So he's down there. He's going to go ahead and videotape this whole thing. Let me tell you something. Somebody has to go first. One, two, three. Not it. Not it. Not it. No. Hey! Casey. I totally beat you. <laughs> that's, that's how we make the business decisions around here at the radio station. All right. I have a timer on my uh, phone, sponsored, uh, brought to us by Plateau. Thank you, Plateau. I've got a... Uh, I don't know they want to be a part of this. <laughs> I've got that. Casey, let me give you your boom box. Casey, here is your box. Okay. Thank you. All right. If you will please head down to the starting line. All right. We have Casey Peacock uh, getting to the starting line. Uh, Len Vos, for some reason, is standing on a street corner. That's just, just another day, really. Well, he heard that... People were going to be picked. Easy, easy. No, 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 no. All right. No. Uh, let's uh, real quick. Casey, uh, how you feeling over there? You got to yell so you reach the microphone. And uh, she's pumped up. Are you ready to go, he, Casey? Has she been, you think she's been drinking? <laughs> Steve, do you think a bear has a hurt? Harry, yeah, never mind. Okay, so here we go. Uh, uh, Casey has that boom box squeezed between her thighs. Are you <laughs> ready? On your, I can't believe I'm saying this on the radio. On your mark. Get set. Go! Uh oh, this is going to take a while, Duff. <laughs> She's making her way. Boy, she has a look of concentration. Oh, the box is slipping from between her thighs, and she has made, made it. it. What was Duffy Moon? What was her time? Oh, that's going to be tough to beat, Steve. 8.9. 8.9 seconds. All right, Casey, come on back here. Uh -huh. uh, Duffy, you're next. Uh, no, 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 no. What's there not in? No, no. We already established the order. Uh, uh, so why don't we why don't you reset that and show uh, Casey how to run the timer real quick. All right, come on over here, Casey. You see it's got a little start button there? I'm only doing this once, so don't you dare miss the start button. All right, let me uh, get this. Uh, All right, why don't you get on down to the starting line here? I've always wanted the radio between my thighs. And yeah, yeah. It's there. All right. Here we go. Right. Here we go. I'm going to go uh, horizontally with the thigh placement. Guys, oh, that's, whoa. <laughs> you see, we have extra parts that Casey didn't have. That's not really fair. All right, I am ready. And I that's that's probably why I'm going to lose, Duffy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's probably why I'm going to ace this. Here we go. I am ready. All right, let's get out, let's get out of his way. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. All right, Duffy Moon is making his way. He's got a wicked duck waddle as he makes his way. He's about two-thirds of the way down the line. His box is slipping, and he made it. Okay, official timekeeper, what is his time? 7.5. Oh! Seven and a half seconds. Did you hear that? Doubters. I'm going pro. Yeah, okay, you're, you're pro, all right. Endorsement. I need an endorsement deal. All right, Stephen. I want you to know that that radio has already been between my thighs, and now it's time. All right, well, God bless you, friends. <laughs> now it's time to place it between yours. And uh, I, I don't want to. 
good, but you have to. No, we don't. There are people counting on you to win this, Steve. I'll buy him tickets. It's all good. <laughs> all right. Steve, down to the starting line. Casey, are you ready with the timer? Yes, I'm ready. What? Did the horizontal uh, strategy seem to work? Well, it got me a better time than Casey. I bet you I'm going to drop my... I'm cold. The steel wouldn't start fast enough. Oh, no, no, no. You're the one running the clock, sister. All right, are you ready? I bet you I'm going to drop my box. Uh, you are indeed. All right. You, the best bet is to place that box horizontally between your thighs. <laughs> That's vertical. You've got a vertical placement there, Steve. Yeah, there we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> there we go. Wow. Yeah. I like how you have the speaker pointed up. All right, here we go. On your mark. Get set. Waddle. Oh, wow. He's got a good run. He's got a good gait. He's got, oh, it's slipping. It's slipping. Done. Ah. Wow. Wow. I, I, I saw this. I saw the time. I saw the score. And I think we've been set up. I think there's doping going on. <laughs> I am pretty sure. Did I win? Uh, Casey's score was an 8.6. Yeah. My score was a 7.5. Yeah. What was mine? Steve score, clearly the fastest box waddle on the high plains. <laughs> A 4.6. Yeah! <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. USA! 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 We, we were all representing the USA, Steve. Yeah, but you're losers. You were representing box waddlers all across this nation. I'm going to take my box and head on back inside now. <laughs> Rooney and Moon in the Morning. The High Plains Best Mix. Mix 107.5.